What's going on everybody, it's Joe here, and I'm um, going to give you a little update on what I had happen yesterday in my exercise slash lifestyle. So I had a pretty nasty mountain bike crash. Um, mountain biking is one of my absolute favorite things to do in the world. No, I'm not flying down the Alps. I'm doing <laughs> basically a lot of single track, some technical stuff. Um, just fun. I've done it for over a decade. But anyway, yesterday, the thing of it, it, thing about it is, things happen. Things happen really quick, and you have to be able to prepare and take care of them. Um, so this and this and a um, little bit of there's a my little one's band aid on there, but. Luckily I didn't break my finger, luckily I didn't break my shoulder or mess anything up. It's very, very sore. feels like I got in a pretty bad car wreck. Basically I was going about 15 miles an hour and my front tire slid off the... Must have hit a rock or something, slid off the trail real quick and threw me literally in the air that way. And I, as you can see, down the rest of my body is uh, all the, most of the skin that wasn't covered with clothes and shorts and whatnot um, is is kind of like that so anyway this took the most of it and my shoulder like I said really really sore I'm gonna chill out on kettlebell stuff so here's basically that's what happened now is what I have to do afterwards so what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna be as active because I just don't feel good at all um, training isn't gonna be the same for a while. Um, I'm going to lower my carbohydrates, probably increase protein and fat to take care of that. Lower calories a little bit. You know, instead of having 3,000 a day, I'm probably going to be having close to 2,800. Already getting this pretty disgusting arm all over everything. <laughs> it's, um, yeah. You don't realize how much your skin tells you, uh, how to move your arm uh, and yeah <laughs> so anyway first time I've really had a big road rash or trail rash I guess you would say anyway um, so I'm lower the calories lower the carbohydrates down a little bit because I'm not going to be using up as much glycogen I am going to work on loosening up that tense tissue in my shoulder doing a whole lot of probably get some massage won't be able to go to the float tank because that will scream the whole time um, unless I get a bunch of tegaderm on it it's basically a bandage that doesn't allow it's a waterproof skin covering um, so that probably some road road biking I'm gonna chill on the mountain bike for a minute uh, just, it, it shakes you up pretty quick um, yeah so anyway that's what happens that's what I'm gonna do about it and we'll see how quickly we get back onto it. I guess the goal is still to work on getting leaner, which is working. I was under 214 pounds for the first time in a long time. Um, so anyway, I will talk to you guys soon. Just a little update. Like I said, anything can happen. you got to just be careful. And when it happens, you have to do your best to work with it. Later.